So pretty much, we're learning about something called flow rate, which you guys actually nailed. So flow rate is the amount of time it takes something to get filled up. When the water comes up to a certain amount, the first light sensor notices it because it sees a change in the amount of light that it can detect because when there's more water there, it doesn't sense as much light. And so it registers a different value in the computer. And our program says, okay, I see water, so start the timer. As the water level rises, it reaches the second light sensor. And now the computer reads a different value, right? And when that computer reads a different value, it stops the timer. So this is what we're going to use to measure the flow rate. As opposed to using a stopwatch, you could say it's better because it's automated. We have a sensor that's detecting when some, a, a state changes from light to dark or from dark to light, as opposed to trying to do it with our eye and hit a stopwatch. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this experiment under three different conditions. One with the big pipe. Ready? Is it running? Yes. All right. So you can see the first light sensor was triggered, the second light sensor was triggered, and it's... Wait, stay, don't move, don't move. All right.